going up! I'm going up! I'm still going up! Oh, no! Well, this is higher than I thought! Can you see all of Spring City, Scoop? Yes! All of it, Mark! Ooh! What does it look like? A long way down. I don't think he likes it as much as he thought he would. Okay, now we've just got to install the elevator car and the... That sounds like school. Oh, no! What's he doing up there? Wishing he was down here by the sound of things. Whoa! Scoop's on board. Okay, Bob. Going down. Oh, oh my. Oh, no. Oh, oh. oh, no. Where did he go? Scoop, are you all right? Oh, no. I'm balancing. But I'm not good at balancing. What are we going to do? There must be a gap. Maybe if I get close enough, if I can just peek through. Hello. Lofty. Oh, I'm really sorry, Bob. I just wanted to see the giraffe. <laughs> All that crashing scared the giraffe. He's run off into the zoo. Oh, dear. I've broken everything and made the giraffe run away. Hey, how dare thee trespass? I command thee to retreat, foul beast. Ha, and don't come back. Leo, is everything secure? It is now, Bob. Ha, ha, ha. That feathery foe was no match for the brave and cunning Prince Fixalot. On guard. Ha-ha! Leo! Leo! Look out! That wasn't supposed to happen, was it? No, it wasn't. And now Leo is trapped! Uh, ah! Fear not, everyone! Nothing Prince fix a -Lot can't fix! I'll simply raise the portcullis like this! The portcullis is too heavy, Leo. It needs two people to crank the winches. <sighs> Guess I'll just have to find a different way out. Another adventure for fearless Prince Fixalot. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> What's wrong, Leo? Uh, there's someone else in here. Oh. I think it's a ghost. A ghost? A ghost? Don't be silly. There are no such things as ghosts. Are there, Bob? <laughs> of course not. <laughs> you don't scare me, ghosty. You're no match for the gallant Prince Fixalot. <laughs> There's nothing to worry about, Leo. The important thing is to stay calm and try not to... Help! Panic. Uh, just sit tight. I've got the perfect plan to get you out. That's great, Bob. What is it? Uh, I haven't thought of it just yet. Bob, if we don't think of something soon, we won't be able to get the castle open for the festival. Lofty, according to my schedule, it's time to hang that rope ladder. Uh, Wendy? Yes? You know that floor panel you just painted? Yes? Um... Safi, wait! The paint's not dry! Wendy, what's wrong? Is everything okay with the treehouse? Yes, everything's fine. I just need to check the paint. Phew, because I really want to amaze the others. 
Lofty, change to the schedule. I'm now repainting the floor. Thanks, Muck. Can you take them to Wendy and quickly? I'm a little behind schedule. Isn't that right, Scoop? Don't worry, Bob. They'll be straightened in no time. Hi, Wendy. Just checking in. I've got the rope ladder in place, the viewing deck ready, and I'm just about to fix the windows. What about the flag for the top of the treehouse? There's a flag. I haven't got a flag on the schedule. <laughs> Don't worry. I'll make the flag. <laughs> Oh, after I fix my workbench. Hold it steady, Lofty. This glue will set the window, but it's very sticky. We don't want to touch it. How sticky is very sticky? Look, Wendy. Pictures of all the Spring City Rockets' favorite things. They're going to be so impressed. Careful of the sticky stuff, Saffy. Don't worry, Lofty. I'll protect the window. Done. Come on, Wendy. Now we can hang the zip line. What's the matter, Wendy? Is everything okay? The treehouse will be ready, won't it? Everything's fine, Safi. You go. I'll be along in a minute. <gasps> Oof! Oh, I see. It's very, very sticky. Okay, everything's in place. Dizzy's arrived with the cement. We just need Bob to bring the flag. Wendy! I've just had the best idea. We can put our biggest trophy inside the treehouse. No, Safi, wait! Dizzy's pouring in cement. How's it going, Hero Wendy? Well, I had to paint the floor panel twice, unstick myself from the wall, and then reseal the window. <laughs> Some hero I am. <laughs> Help! What was that? Oh no! Sappy! Why were you up there, Sappy? The treehouse isn't ready yet. I guess I didn't wait long enough for the cement to dry. <gasps> the trophy! It's still up there! Oh, what have I done? So. How are you, Betsy? Well, uh, I've been better, Scoop. I've got this funny rattle, you see? Sounds like junk in your trunk. I beg your pardon? You need to get that looked at quickly. But Curtis isn't here and Bob's much too busy. Well, you seem to know what you're talking about. Yes, I do, don't I? Thank you. In fact... Follow me! Coming through! Coming through! Minibus in need of immediate mechanical attention. Just pop on there, Bets. Scoop, what are you up to? Nothing for you to worry about. Oh, I always get worried when he says that. I really don't think you should mess around with the lift before Bob checks it's working, okay? Here we go. Up, up, up. That should do it. Now, where's the stop button? Scoop! Where's the stop button? Oh, no! Betsy! Betsy, are you okay? I'm fine, Bob. A small little scratch to my paint job, but it looks like your new garage roof got it worse. <laughs> there are too many bricks here for me to carry in one trip, Leo. That's okay, Scoop. We can get Muck to carry those. Um, where is Muck? I haven't seen him in hours. Muck, what are you doing? Hey, Scoop, catch this! Scoop, no! Now get this one! I want to turn. Oh, Lofty, not you too. Slow down, Lofty. I can't.
What are we going to do? I think the first thing would be to get this... If you're waiting for a dinosaur, it's your lucky day. I've got a really large one here. Oh, wow! It's amazing! Very impressive. Lovely bone structure. Okay, let's get it inside. Oh, careful now. That skeleton is 65 million years old. Thank goodness it's not a new one. Easy does it. Hold it still a minute. I gotta get some pictures. Oh, beautiful. Uh, that doesn't look right. Uh, that is never going to get through there. What? But I gave you the exact measurements. What have you done? Oh, you told Bob the doors had to be six yards wide and three yards high. Yes. No. I, I, oh, I meant to say six yards high and three yards wide. Oh, dear me. Uh-oh. This is very bad. The door is too short and the dinosaur is too tall. It's never going to fit inside. But it has to. Mayor Madison is coming soon to make sure everything's ready for tomorrow's opening. But there's no way that dinosaur is going to get through those doors. What about sideways? Scoop. Uh, there might be a way. If we take the skeleton apart, we can carry all the bones inside, then put them back together again. I don't think that's such a good idea, Lofty. We shouldn't do anything drastic till Bob gets back. But it's getting late, and Mayor Madison will be here soon. I think it's a brilliant idea, Lofty. Come along, everyone. There's a T-Rex to take apart. Dear, this thing is so fiddly. I think this one goes up here. Oh, dear. No, it can't be right. Maybe this one. Ugh. No, no, no. You've got it all wrong. Oh, this large one must be part of the uh, leg. So it must go here. Uh, oh, doesn't seem to fit. Oh, uh, what about this small one, then? It's part of the tail, isn't it? it uh, or maybe the left foot? No? Oh, dear. What on earth? What happened? Sorry, Bob. It's all my fault. I was just trying to help. No, Lofty. I'm the guilty party, I'm afraid, Bob. I got this fellow's height and width all mixed up. We couldn't get the skeleton through the doors. So we took it apart. And now we can't remember how to put it back together again. I'm sure we can fix it. Can't we? First up, star jumps! Go, team, go! That's not exercise, Leo. Is so. I'm exercising my thumb. How am I doing, Sky? Careful, Scoop. Sorry, I'm just excited about competing in the fun run. Uh, I don't know how to tell you this, Scoop, but you're not competing. Oh, but I want to break a world record, just like Sky. I'm sorry, Scoop, but the fitness trail is only built for people. Speaking of which, could you two give me a hand with the swing bridge, please? We'll need to tie the ropes with strong knots. It's not fair. Everyone else gets to have fun in the fun run. To the far tree, gentlemen. Start your engines. Ready, set, go! Yes, it's like Sky says. Never give up. Nothing can stop me now.
that wasn't as hard as I thought. Scoop, what have you done this time? I'm sorry, Bob. I just wanted to be like Sky and break a record. Well, you definitely broke something. Oh, dear. The fun run starts in an hour, and we haven't even finished the rope bridge. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. oh, no. I'm dancing. I can do it. I can. Dum dee dum do da 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 dee dum do Come on, Mr. Bentley. I have to be perfect for tonight. Once more with feeling. Gently, Bentley, bend the knees. Wow, it's huge. Imagine dancing on that, Sappy. Is this my dance floor? Sylvan! Yay! It isn't finished yet, Mr. D'Souza. We need to add the plywood layers and dance surface. I would like to see this, please. Of course. Lofty, can you grab the plywood, please? It would be an honor, Bob. Watch us dance, Sylvan! I wish I could do that. Lofty! Uh... Oh, my dance floor! Oh, no! Mr. D'Souza, oh. I'm so sorry! I should have known I was too big and clumsy to go near a dance floor, let alone dance on one. Please let me fix this for you. It was an accident. And he really does want to dance. Okay, Lofty, lift it up. Hold it, Lofty. Two-ton, move out. No problem, Bob. Lofty, really carefully, please, move the screen towards the frame. There. And finally, we can take away the scaffold towers. That all looks nice and sturdy. Quick! The screen is falling! The supports are falling too! Don't worry, I'll help! Quick, everyone! Let's move to a safe distance! Leo, what happened? Why did the supports come away from the frame? And why did the frame break? Uh, it wasn't Leo's fault. It was mine. I left Leo without any help because I wanted to help the Spring City Rockets instead. I am so sorry. But it is my fault. I never should have tried to do such a big job by myself. I'm sorry, Bob. And I'm sorry, too. I kept asking for Lofty's help. Wow. That's a lot of sorries and a lot to fix. I'm not a jockey. I'm a cowboy. Woohoo! Well, builders and cowboys don't really mix. Leo, you'll be pleased that we're here to build extra stables for those horses we just saw. They're not just any horses, Bob. They're thoroughbred race horses. They're extra fast and extra nervous. I've been trying to catch them all morning. So please don't scare them again. Can he keep the noise down? Not really, Henry. But I don't want to hear beep beep in my yard, only clip clop. Well, now the panels are here, we can get started. Don't worry, 
You'll have your stables in no time. Good. It's the Spring City Sprint tomorrow. Those horses need a good night's sleep before the big race. Yeehaw! Ride em, cowboy! When you're ready, Wendy. Lofty, prepare to lower. Okay. And lower. No, 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 no! I told you! Please don't scare the horses! Oh, sorry. I, I forgot. This is a racetrack, not a rodeo. Last stack of straw bales and we're done! Wasn't supposed to happen, was it? Where are my racehorses? Uh, they went that away. No, they're heading for the racetrack. Uh, that's okay. I'll put them back. Uh, okay. So this teddy here goes back here on the teddy shelf. Oh no. There's a skateboard and a jigsaw on the teddy shelf. Where's the skateboard shelf? Uh, I don't know. Where's the jigsaw shelf? Uh... What's wrong? <laughs> Nothing. I'm just a tiny bit confused. Oh, no! Why don't you press the undo button a few times? That's a good idea, Scoop. Look it up. Uh-oh. This is very bad. Does... Minnie's enjoying it? I've never seen Leo move so quickly. Come on, Leo. Where are you? I really need that wrench. Ah, there you are. Have you got my... Uh, wrench? Uh, no, because a robot arm got me! Uh, oh, no! Uh, oh, no! Uh, uh. Bob, I've been boxed up. It's all right. I'll get you out. Oh, dear. My robotic picking system. It's not responding. Oh, no. I should have never touched it. I am so sorry. Can it be reprogrammed, Roland? Yeah, but that's going to take ages. Oh, we'll never get all the toys into the delivery vans by the end of the day now. Oh. I've ruined Christmas. We'll figure something out. Come on, Robot Picker Arm, get to work. <laughs> oh, we were only just getting going. Why are people always taking breaks? Us machines don't need to. I thought we were on a break. No time to stop. More Earth to get. Uh, there's usually a good reason why we've stopped. Oh, you're right. <laughs> I got carried away trying to race Scoop. Is Scoop still digging? Yes, faster than ever. Scoop, you can stop digging now. I've stopped. You win. <laughs> nice try, Max, but I'm not falling for that one. You just want me to stop, so you can win! No! I don't care about losing the challenge! Well, I do! I've been waiting ages to get this build started. 
I know the feeling. These are exciting times for uh, Spring City. Uh, Bob? Nothing says busy, bustling business like a skyscraper does. Bob? Wendy? Hmm. You've gone much too deep, Scoop. I said as deep as three school buses, remember? You could fit a whole fleet of buses in there. Right. Let's see what you've hit. It looks like some kind of wall. Let's just fill the hole up again. Sorry, Muck, but when you find something unexpected in the ground, you have to stop work. It's hard to tell for certain, but this wall could be really old and special. I'll go and call Anish Bose, the archaeologist. The archi what it is? Archaeologist. They're people who help teach us about the olden days by finding things that have been buried underground for hundreds of years. Huh? They're experts in digging stuff up. I thought that was me. <laughs> I think you've done enough digging for today, Scoop. Yes, there is no doubt. This is one of the most exciting discoveries in years. This is extremely bad news. Underneath this earth lies the remains of a wall from Roman times. From a fort or a villa, probably. Oh, Roman. What's that? The Romans were people who lived here about 2,000 years ago. They were excellent builders. Ooh, just like us. Talking of building, Professor Bose, when can we get building again? Well, hard to say, but this dig is going to take at least a month. A, a month? month? That's ages. I did all that in just one morning. Aha, but unlike you, we have to dig very slowly and very carefully. Well, no wonder it takes so long. Your brushes are way too tiny. Well, looks like we've got no choice. We'll have to stop working. Hello, everyone. Oh, dear. I've come to get a progress report for the mayor. Sorry, Mr. Bentley. I'm afraid there won't be any progress. No progress? Oh, dear me, no. Mayor Madison won't be at all happy. I... Why don't you come to my office? Have a nice cup of tea. The mugs are four inches deep. Well, that certainly is generous. 